Hey guys, it's Drew Chantel and welcome back to my channel. And today I have um, BJ's Brew House. Now in my last video, I said I was going to make potato tacos. However, I just decided that I wanted to go to BJ's because I did have a $10. I had a $10 reward that I wanted to use. <sighs> so let me tell you what happened. Okay, so first let me tell you what I have. So I this is a kid's meal. So this is just barbecue pizza with, I'm sorry, this is barbecue sauce with green bell peppers only. And then I have, I got a side of french fries as my side. And then I ordered garlic knots. And then this is a Pepsi. This comes with the, um, we'll have a small Pepsi here that comes with the kids meal. And then I have a large Pepsi. Let me tell you what happened. So I always order online or I try to call in because I like my pizza with no cheese. And every time there's cheese on it even though there's an option for no cheese. So I ordered my food, I even tried calling them but they didn't answer the phone. So I order my food like normal and of course they give you the option of how you want, a lot of green bell peppers, they give you the option of how you would like the um, pizza prepared. So I of course get no cheese on it. It's literally an option. No cheese, no tomato, whatever you want. But every time they give me cheese. Get there after waiting 30 minutes. And the cashier is going nice. She's like, oh, um, I just want to confirm you wanted no cheese. I'm like, yes, thank you. So I get to the car and I didn't check my pizza inside because the cashier had told me he had already told the kitchen that I wanted no cheese. This is the car, open the box up, there's cheese. So, go back inside and this time a man comes out, he happened to be the manager, but he didn't know that something was wrong. And he's like, oh, um, can I help you? And I just turned the box and I'm like, this is wrong. He's probably figuring out like, why is it wrong? I'm like, it's supposed to be no cheese. It's just supposed to be barbecue sauce and green bell peppers. I said, unfortunately, this happens every time I order. It literally says no cheese, no tomato, and they always put both. So, now the cashier comes back out. He's like, I told them no cheese. And then still put cheese. So he's like, oh, sorry, we're going we're gonna to make it a new one for you right now. Okay. So. He's like, um, what, do you, what else do you have in your bag? So I'm on. I have garlic knots and I have fries. He goes, okay, well, the garlic knots will be, are fine. He goes, but let me make you fresh fries. Is that perfect? I mean, he's like. What kind of drink did you have? I was like, oh, I had a Pepsi, so he gave me another big Pepsi. And then he was like, you know what? I'm gonna give you a gift card or whatever. I said, okay. I didn't know how much it was for, I was just so irritated. So the one guy that I like, who's always there, who always makes sure, like he, even though he tells the kitchen staff like, oh, no cheese, he makes sure before it comes out, there's no cheese on it. So I told the manager, I'm like, oh, there's a guy here named blah, blah, blah. He always gives me order right. Like he double checks, like even before it comes out. He's like, yeah, he got a real job. And I was like, what do you mean a real job? I know what he meant, but um, I was like, yeah, he went to school for, I don't know what, and now he works at this other job and he's only here a couple of days a week. I was like, well, a job is a job and you know, at least he's working, you know. Well guys, I'm getting full, all these carbs, <laughs> but so good. I love the garlic knots, they're so good. Mm. 
I just realized. I got mayonnaise sauce for my sister. So she could have some. Garlic knots. Better for going mayonnaise sauce. I just don't understand what's happening. The last time I went, they, um, my, like I said, my pizza was raw, but also she didn't have my side of fries that I ordered, or well, comes with the side of fries. She forgot my side of fries and my drink. So I was like, wait a minute, I'm missing stuff. I'm so, I don't know, I just don't understand. But anyways, hopefully my next time, my next experience won't be as bad. I don't know, it's not like it's bad, it's just that every time you order food, you want the food to be correct. And you're already waiting half an hour to order the food online. Because if I order the food before I leave, it'll be cold by the time I get there. So what I do is order the food right when I get there. And then like, if I want to like walk around or do whatever, I can, you know, I can run to a store or something really fast. Um, but like I said, if I order it before I leave, it'll sit there and be cold. So I don't know. We'll see. But thank you guys for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up. I'll see you next time. And I will let you guys know at the end of this video how much the um, gift card was for. And then I'll have to go back and see if um, I have a better experience. And you know what? I should order the same exact thing exactly to the t to see if it comes out correct and if it doesn't then i know that it's definitely not me so until next time bye guys thanks for watching so not sure couldn't get through i'm guessing it's no more than ten dollars